in a world NTA nationwide. I am Runke Kolawale. President Mohamedou Buhari has reaffirmed the commitment of his administration towards stabilizing the country and making it more functional and responsive to public aspirations for sustainable future. The president stated this while hosting the nation's youth and artists to the breaking of Ramadan fast. State House correspondent Adam Sambo reports. I'm very pleased to share this uh, breakfast with you. It's part of your money. President Muhammad Buhari, who described the youth as well as the artists as the nation's hope for greatness, appreciated their contributions so far to the growth and enhancement of the economy. His administration, he promised, will continue to do its best towards dismantling obstacles to the realization of national aspirations so that the country can effectively utilize her resource endowments for a prosperous future. We are over 180 million. We are almost the rest of Africa still put together. I think the expectation is very, very high. So the pressure here is tremendous. But I cannot complain because I asked for it so many times. We are trying very hard to normalize the situation in the country for you. I wish you the best of Nigeria. Spokespersons for the groups thank the president for keeping the nation's hope alive and promise continued support and cooperation in the implementation of the Change Nigeria project. We are doing a lot. Um, we take us to the promised land. We certainly will believe in you and um, um, the credit industry also believe in you. This is a government for the people, by the people, and we are deeply appreciative of the fact that we carry you for long. It was also an opportunity for the participants to make some requests, observations, and suggestions on the best way forward for Nigeria. We are passionately calling on Mr. President to revisit the issue of the Fem village in Kano. Chebi uh, has never had it this good. For the first time, Chebi has been in the limelight in terms of agriculture. We can only say thank you to Mr. President. I was just happy to see him healthy and uh, strong and you know, his dedication to the country and the youths. And we want him to continue what he has started already, fighting corruption because that is the hydra-headed monster that is actually dragging this country backward. I want to call on Nigerian youth to understand that this man is fighting for their future. The legend of Nigerian youth are behind them. President should fire on. We're happy with what he's doing. We pray that he's re-elected for the second time to continue the good work. By the time he will live in 2023, we the young people will have a better country to inherit and continue building from where he may stop. The breaking of the Ramadan fast continues. From the State House, Adam Musambu, NTA News.